It was a really good practice. Uh, defense had a couple lapses, but other than that, they did well. Um, offensively, we got some things accomplished that we wanted to get done as far as some install stuff. So it was it was a good it was good practice. I mean, it's uh, guys are showing who they are. So that's that's what we wanted out of here. <laughs> The evaluation process, so it's it's gone very well. How like cornerbacks look like they made some plays. Yeah, they did. You know, you know, there's still a couple of times we let a guy let a ball get outside of us. There's still some contain issues we got to be better about. And then we also made a bad play. We gave him a we, we gave him a fourth down uh, conversion in uh, two minutes because we panicked. We just grabbed a guy and didn't have to. You know, we got to be better about trusting our technique. So, but they did. They played well, and I think a lot of it is the communication. A lot of them, they're starting to understand what's being asked of them. You said at the beginning of spring ball that one of the things you wanted to do was find out who could play. What happens to the guys who can't play? <laughs> what happens to them? Yeah. Well, some of them, uh, they can't play, and they're not doing what they're supposed to do academically, and they're not doing some other things, and buying into the program won't be here. I mean, it's just that simple. You know, guys, I told them when I got hired, they had a, you know, everyone has a clean slate. So this will be uh, four months to show me if you want to be a part of this. I told them it's a privilege to be a Buffalo. It's not a right. So they've had uh, since December set, uh, 7th to show they want to be here. Some guys don't want to be here by body language, by how they work in the weight room, by how they work in the classroom, by how they work in the football field. So. So if that means you're going to you know, part ways with them, when will that happen and how will that happen? Uh, when and how? Uh, obviously sometime after spring. And, and then how is me telling them. You know, I'll, I'll tell them. I won't put it on a position, Coach. I'll explain to them why. And, you know, we have, you know, let them. Let them, let them know why. Well, have they been called on the carpet first, the ones that you asked to leave? Uh, they know, know, they know what's carpet. coming? I mean, you've, you've warned them, basically. So you got to pick it up. Oh, they've gonna been warned many times. Okay. Yeah, there's no surprises. <laughs> I mean, I, I've told everyone from day one, everyone's year to year. It's like a, like a CEO, you let the guys under you fire themselves. Yeah, I mean, it's simple. I mean, it's like I tell them, I don't ask a lot. Mm -hmm. I want effort. I want you to compete. I want you to do it on and off the field. That's basically all I ask. Mm -hmm. Be on time. Mm -hmm. And I think those are pretty simple rules. And for some guys, that's they can't do that. So one, one of the other things you talked about was building toughness. How's the building toughness part coming? Good. We're physical. You know, the way we practice without pads, the way that we uh, are starting to chase the ball and grab guys and guys have a little bit of edge. They don't like guys grabbing and holding on them anymore, you know. Um, guys um, getting after each other. So it's, it's, it's been a very good spring from that standpoint. It has. I, I think I know they, they understand how to practice. And they, you know, it's been pretty grueling. We've, we've done a lot of hitting. And, uh, you know, we've been on them. They've been coached very hard. And, you know, there's 95% of the guys have responded. So that's, I'm, I'm very happy about that.